Good day everybody, welcome to today's video. Today's video, we are going to replace a CV clamp that we repaired quite some time ago with a zip tie. The zip tie is held up, and I think I should probably fix it properly. This should be an interesting little project. So let's get started. Instead of doing it outside in the snow, I waited till it got nice out. Gonna try this new tool I got. And I got some clamps here as well. This is the clamp we got. We're gonna put it on. Roll it tight, fold it over here with this tool, and then snip her off. We'll see what's going to happen. Well, the zip tie worked in a pinch. Now it's time to cut it off, fix it properly. Not gonna lie, there wasn't a lot of room, so it was kind of awkward to get my big hands in there to feel around, get that strap on, make sure the boot is on properly, and then we're gonna put the tool on it and start winding it. Right here I'm just feeding the strap into the tool itself and then I'm going to pull it a little bit tight. Once you get her fed on, you just start winding it, turning it and turning it, and the band just keeps on tightening up. At this point, point I got it tight so I'm going to bend it down fold it over top of where that crimp piece is and then I'm going to back it off a little bit so I have some extra strap there and I'm going to use the cutter on the side pull that up cut it I actually cut it a little bit long but then I trim it up and I'm using a punch to punch it down flat and then there's two tangs on the side that I'm folding over and then punching them in and hopefully now it'll stay. There we go. I just need to get it started. Drop that fucker down. There you have it. That was a pretty quick job. Took about 10 minutes. I ended up cutting the band a little shorter at the end. And uh, hopefully it'll stay. The zip tie stayed, so I'm hoping this band will. We'll find out. We'll check it again in a few weeks, maybe a couple months. All right, well, I'm going to end the video there. If you guys watched this video, then obviously the video turned out all right. I was trying to get the best image I can by using the camera that is on a magnetic tripod on the side of the frame, plus use a GoPro Hero. Who knows how it's going to turn out. This tool is well worth the money. It's not very expensive, and you never know when you're going to need it, basically. There's a hole in the front of it right there. You'll feed the strap through, make sure this piece is turned back, and then wind it through here, tighten it up, tighten it up, and then fold it back over where your little tangs are, if you have the tangs, and then move that forward, cuts the strap, you're off to the races. Anyways, I'm gonna get going. If you guys have any questions or comments, post them below. Otherwise, I wanna thank you guys for watching.